We're living in a nice condo. Check this out on 22 Wellesley. 22 Wellesley. There is a BLM. It's like, what are you rising up against? You live in a nice condo. I live in a shithole. With with my well, uncle, with my wonderful uh, uncle here. Actually, uh, unfortunately, while on one hand, you know, it's it's a matter of appearance, and not everybody in the black community likes Black Lives Matter. They don't represent no. everyone. They and represent they, the white man's interest. They do, and people don't understand why. It's the intersectionalism issue. Yeah. You know they they. You know, done a lot of posturing, but the truth is they fall fallen way short of the mark. But we never, as a gay community, or a Jewish community, either one, ever an invaded an event of the black communities on a negative front. So, you know, while they showed up at our parade, you know, the truth of it was that they didn't bother in their sign saying GLBT of color, you know, a black GLBT lives matter too. They left it out when they did that. That spoke to what they were really doing. Had they included that, you know, that would have been a different ball game. But they didn't. And then they got indignant when we asked them to remove themselves from the parade because they were not there to do anything but be divisive, try to uh, disinclude our minority group status by misusing theirs to suggest that we are not a legitimate and bona fide minority community of which we are. Yeah. So, that's, that's the issue I have. I, I get it, the ethnocentrism. I understand it's white male heteropatriarchal breakdown. I see it. It's not the Rainbow Coalition, not that I like North Carolina, but I did like Jesse Jackson, regardless of what anyone had to say about it. And certainly, you know, the NAACP issue. We know what happened to Ben Chavez and the Wilmington 10, we know the story. And why would anyone support Ann Hintz? You know, excuse me, you know, how do you know self respect But, you know, or David Gowan, Mr. Joe Mengele, Dr. Joe Mengele. But you see, this is about politics and breakdown. And in the Jewish community, we have them too. Oh yeah, the Judenrat, the oh, Jewish yeah. Council. They're, they're there. It's, you know, they're on Spadina and... Uh, and Bloor. And Bloor. Yeah, we have them there too. We have them in the gay community. Oh you yeah, know, the capos, I believe. The capo. You know, we have the in the Jewish community. We have our capos, our you know, our Jew and, and the gay community is the same. You know, you know, but but if you're going to stand up for for your rights as a minority class, make sure that you do it cohesively. You know, in other words, that you are not disincluding anyone at the same time, or trying to suggest that. You know, a certain group is not a bona fide minority class. Because when you do that, it bounces back on you. Yeah. And then you can't be mad or upset for anybody and anyone for calling it out. Yeah. You know, it's true. So not everybody's going to like this mouthful, but I don't really care. Yeah. I'm, uh, you know, I'm a strong proponent of the black community and across the board, and yeah. I always have been. Yeah. You know, but no bullshit on me and expect me to like it or, or yeah. believe it. Yeah, don't shit in our cornflakes and tell us it's chocolate syrup. Yeah. yeah. Like, we don't do that to you. No. We don't go to your events and do that. And no. By the way, we don't Jews. go to your events, period. You know, we're Jews. We've been supportive of you all along. You know, the Mississippi burning, you remember that? Hello, we were there. Yeah. Yeah, we were. I mean, right. I mowed down just like you did. Yeah. So, you know, we've had our own hell in the game. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's nothing small. Nothing. I mean, it's, you know, Germany, Hitler, you know, it was before that. And Hitler was a gay Jew. Yeah. He was a gay yeah, Jew. Yeah. Well, we don't pull any punches. It is what it is, you know. 
He was also Catholic. How about that? You know, yes. a jack of all trades. You know, yeah. I mean, in a manner of speaking, everybody has a right to be who they are. Yeah. But he really took this to a level that was beyond the way. Yeah. I mean, this madman was created by a society. Yeah. We keep creating these people. Yeah, and, and worshiping them. And we, you know, get, we have invaders, we have privacy invaders, we have infiltrators among our minority communities yeah. that try to create uh, conflict and tension between groups yeah. and inside of them. And that's what we're talking about right now. Yeah. You know, it, we, we want unification and uni, uni, uniformity and unifying across minority group lines. Yeah. They're inclusive. You know, and we want it to be better than the Rainbow Coalition. We want it to be a new level of awareness. And until you really look at intersectionalism, face the reality of what it actually means, which is that you can't be one type of prejudice if you have, you know, and just say that you don't have every other type. Yeah. That's not reality. I'm sorry. If you're, you know, if you're racist, you're anti-Semitic, you're homophobic, you're misogynistic, you're, you know, yeah. you, you hate everyone. Jews, yeah. you know, gay folk, you know. It is what it is, you know, yeah. if you're black and you're trying to say that you're, you know, Mary Poppins, but you you don't like gays or Jews or both of us, well, you know, you don't like yourself either. And, you know, I hate clearly to say they, this, they beat themselves with the ugly stick every day. Racism and homophobia, all of it's the same. There's an yeah. occult building, another occult building. There are historical differences and, but where, oh, yeah, yeah. over here? Yeah. Same kind of idea, yeah. colonialism, occultism. Yeah, we all over the city, the architecture yeah. betrays the yeah. past. It tells, in other words, not betrays, but in, in a word, in, in a world that says... That, that betrays everybody. Betrays everybody and talks about human rights, yeah. but then lives out this particular legacy, which, you know, dates back to the architecture of the building. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and before, you know, it's obvious that, you know, this is very early yeah. in human growth, and it's how long have we been here. So, you know, it's been the rise and fall of civilizations, yeah. the cause of it. Here, let's light one of these things. Okay.